Hi Gemini, it's L here to do your love short. Your love short. Love short. Okay, yep. Yeah. All right. You know, that's a play on Love Shack. Anyway, um, thank you, Gemini, for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this, Gemini. Thank you, Lord God, for blessing the Gemini with a clear, concise message from you. All right, Gemini. Gemini. <laughs> Uh, Gemini, let's see what's going on for you. Gemini, Gemini, all of that. All right, let's see. Oh, the two of pentacles. Okay. So somebody's, a decision is up in the air. Somebody's juggling something, trying to keep it all up. Okay. Um, knowing that a decision needs to be made in terms of maybe a relationship. This is about love. So we want to relate it to love. It could be you juggling multiple people people understand in the two of pentacles that there is a person watching there are people watching so you need to live your life like other people are watching somebody could be in that juggling act juggling you juggling somebody else juggling another life and you or you are doing this gemini and it's effortless the funny thing about the two of pentacles it talks about juggling but it says it's not stressful so somebody doesn't feel like this is stressful at all or it's um it's taxing on their energy they kind of like it they're in the groove they're doing two things at one time simultaneous I mean, yeah that word seven of wands coming out seems as if i don't know there could be a relationship here where someone is just trying to keep it um corner or keep it maybe sex only or keep it where it's only an energy of uh we're doing stuff you know we don't know exactly where it's going but we're, we're continuously doing stuff i see you you see me um they're trying to keep the boundaries up in terms of the relationship they don't want it to progress to anything else the eight of pentacles here this also could be someone saying you know don't come over here messing with me and trying to mess with my energy especially if you don't have anything to offer me because it seems as if somebody wants to destruct what you have constructed gemini for yourself someone wants to come in and have that destructive influence they want attention on them it says with the seven of wands trying to get a love a loved one attention and maintain it so i don't know if this is you or someone else but the eight of pentacles it says that maybe this is a cyclical relationship it goes in cycles where it's hot and it's cold it's off and it's on we're in the eighth month this is the eight of pentacles it's time for you to put some energy time energy time energy effort into yourself right now into what works for you um you've been doing something over and over again and it seems as if you haven't gotten a, spe a specific return or a significant return on it the Eight of Pentacles says that maybe you're trying to start something for yourself too, but you just keep getting sidetracked or distracted by. The Two of Cups here. Could be trying to work hard and work, work smarter and get something started and love comes in and distracts you. It seems as if maybe you're in a relationship where it goes, where it's really intense, it's really good, and then it goes really bad and it's really disconnected and it's just drama filled. But there's still love there and you guys want to come back and reconcile and forgive and let bygones be bygones and just let me feel with love and all of those things so it seems as if you go from hot and cold off and on this is the cycle that the relationship goes in with the two of cups here the page of pentacles it seems as if yeah um the relationship may be unstable you know, there's a lot of instability. Maybe a lot of false starts where we think we're going in this direction and then here comes a shit storm. Five of Swords, yeah. And then the Five of Swords talks about reversal and then here comes the reversal. We go backwards, we don't go forwards. Something comes in and causes interference, disruption, distortion, discord just dis all together dismay to where it just doesn't work 
and then there's bad blood and then there's selfishness and then there's ego and then there's aggression maybe even deception here or the two of you take on this win-win type of attitude i want to win i want to win the argument i want to win the who cannot talk to each other the longest tower comes here it's like the tower comes maybe to help you guys understand that this relationship was built on faulty ground I don't know how you got started how it started but the tower talks about historical reference so go back in history in terms of your relationship and see how it started see what's going on see where the problems are because the problem is not new it's not something out of the blue, out of the air, out of thin air. This has historical reference. It seems as if this is something you sweep under the rug and the spirit keeps saying, no, no, no. It keeps lifting the rug up for you guys to deal with it. Break down this old foundation, this old paradigm and start new. Deal with old issues so you can move forward or it's always gonna be um, reversal and tower moments upheaval sudden upheaval where the fuck did this come from is what you guys both probably you both are saying because it goes good and then it just goes to where the fuck did this come from well how are we here let's get some advice for the gemini seven of pentacles wow uh taurus had the seven of pentacles evaluate where you are we're in the eighth month okay for the eighth month we had one all the way up to seven one to seven months so evaluate where you are and see how your relationship your marriage your business partnership whatever you're in how see how it is going is there frustration but they're still wanting an, uh, a desire to see this through what can change about you what do you need to take a passive approach in what do you need to shift here with the seven of pentacles are you persevering are you going to see an actual return on your investment? In Seven of Pentacles just asks you to evaluate thus far where you're going, what you're doing. Evaluate what hasn't been working for one to seven months and possibly do something different in this eighth month. Think of the eighth anything as a one. One year, you get the opportunity to start over, to start again, to start anew. To do something differently. So that's the advice for you, Gemini. I hope that this reading resonated for you. If it did, go over to the website, book your own reading there, take advantage of the text question where you can text the question to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link or you can just buy me a glass of wine. I'm okay with either. Thank you, Gemini. Many blessings to you. Take care.